Chicago Sun-Times columnist Robert Novak has died after a year-long battle with brain cancer. The newspaper says the longtime Washington fixture died at his home early Tuesday. Novak made headlines in 2003 when he identified Valerie Plame as a CIA operative in his column. Although illegal, he was never charged with a crime. In July of 2008, doctors discovered Novak had a malignant brain tumor. Just five days earlier, he had struck a pedestrian in Washington with his car. He told reporters he didn't see the man. But witnesses say the victim was sprawled across the hood of Novak's black Corvette. Days later, Novak said he fell ill while visiting his daughter on Cape Cod. He was rushed to a nearby hospital where doctors performed tests and discovered the tumor. Soon after, Novak announced he was retiring from journalism. He had been a columnist for decades and also co-hosted a show on CNN. He was 78. Diane Kepley, The Associated Press.